Dallas, are you receiving us? Because if you ain't, we're going to make sure that you will. We've got two nights to do it too. Right, well, first of all, it... Oh, yeah. First of all, oh, yeah. First of all, we'd like to say it's great to be back here. Last time we came here, we didn't feel quite as fit as we do now. So, uh... That's one good thing, right? Secondly, we've got a new album out that seems at last we've got an album. Some new material for you to listen to, which we intend to play ce soir. And thirdly, we intend to play bits and pieces from the six and a half year career that we've managed to. managed to keep together all that time. Do you believe that, Constable? It's amazing. Um, so here we all are, still the same people, more or less, give or take a brain cell. So we do some new stuff, some old stuff, and some pretty good stuff.
Thank you very much for that applause.
I'd like to bid you all good health. I'd like to bid myself good health too. Let's, anyway, let's not get too atmospheric too quick. I mean, don't get too vibey too quick, you know? Um, so anyway, this LP that we got together called Physical Graffiti, um, really the title representing uh, one of the many facets of our leisure hours when we are traveling around the, the world or whatever. This is a track from it. It goes back to the roots of, of all music that English people took their notes from years and years ago. And strangely enough, it's called In My Time of Dying.
on that down, let's put your hands together. Come on, 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 let me hear you now. Oh, yeah. Oh, my dear. 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 Oh, my Jesus. Help me, Jesus. Ooh, yeah. Mr. John Bonham. Good evening. Well, all we succeeded at the end of that number was getting totally tangled up. So if you'll excuse us for a minute. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Look at that, see a band full of initiative. Man, what have I done? We're doing that, actually, we're going straight from here to Vegas. Where we do a summer season when Elvis finishes. Now, so we said we were going to do some of the, um, the material from the past. Uh, now, well, nat well, naturally, we can't do any from the future, can we? So, I mean, it doesn't really... Des I mean, we like you to applaud, but um, there's times, you know? So, we've had many, many experiences. Uh, if you'll shut up a minute, I'll try and carry on. We've had many, many experiences around the world. Quite a few hairy ones. And a lot of good times with a lot of good people. And so... Hence the song remains the same.
It's turning into a gospel meeting. <laughs> this is a track from um, another track from Physical Graffiti that takes us to a land far, far removed from this Western society that we scratch around in. It's a track called Kashmir.
John Paul Jones played Mellotron. A very cheap form of orchestration. And he doesn't cost that much to rent either. John's been, um, John Paul that is, since he had his hair cut, he's taken to watching Liberace on the TV and, um, and playing around with the piano a lot more. <laughs> and so he insists that we... He also plays at Blackpool on the summer season in England. Why don't you wake up? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Perhaps, perhaps, it's, only, perhaps it's because I only got up at half past four this afternoon that I'm, I'm, my morning is just beginning. This is a track that features John Paul Jones exercising the fingers and looking rather groovy as well. He's a croupier in Vegas on his days off. A very serious change of mood as we go down into the subconscious. No quarter.
Paul Jones, piano. Yes, 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 yes. Right, now <clears throat> we've been down there. So it's time to move things a little bit. Uh... For anybody who made it to Fort Worth last night, for both of you, in fact, <laughs> is a, a track of of physical graffiti which relates to the uh, to the motor car. And as you you people from the from the United States know that your musical heritage, a lot of it, the blues, which 
inspired we English folk in the early 60s and so on. Uh, there was a guy called Robert Johnson who wrote a lot of beautiful blues things. He was the forerunner of Elmore James and had all the blues bands, John Mayle and all that sort of thing, you know? And he wrote songs about motor cars. And motor cars are relative. Imagine the thumping of the pistons. Imagine the grinding of the valves. Imagine, well, the relativity between the car and the human frame. If you leave your young lady alone, please, sir. <laughs> this is called Trampled Underfoot.
Thank you. We'd like to bid a good evening and a nice warm welcome home and welcome back to Toby Roberts, our spiritual guidance, guidance and the man who falls asleep in the Brussels in New Orleans. Thank you, Toby. <laughs> I'm sorry if we seem to be very happy. We have to keep apologising. It's terrible to look out into an audience where everybody's very flat-faced, you know? These days there isn't enough smiling going on, you know that? So we intend, we intend to inject a little bit of it into you. But now for some precision, now for one of the finest, finest musical sights that you're likely to experience within the next 15 minutes. And that is, ladies and gentlemen, our percussionist. The man with only two cavities, John Bonham, Moby Dick. <laughs> 